here we are in the Cadiz market, <laughs> tasting a Camarón fritters. Tortilla de Camarones. Tortilla de Camarones. We're on a gastro tour. Chris um, Jack's doing research for his business. Yes. If you would like some high quality catering and you live in the um, Newcastle Hexham area, Jack's the person to speak to. We cover Duck the House, whole of the northeast. Duck House Catering. Has he been doing catering for private jets now? Like, wow. Such a selection of seafood in Cadiz Market. These crystal prawns. Transparent. The boutique de Hamon. <coughs> Jack's gone there because it's a boutique, so he thinks it's going to be expensive, which is what he tends to like, unlike myself. Goes for all the expensive stuff because he thinks it's the best, and it's not always true. Where's the best then? Tell me. Uh, Tell well, me where it's the, good. well, lots of things are good, but they don't have to be expensive. Like the so best ham on you need ham on de bayota, which okay. is pigs fed on acorns. Oh yeah. Oh. What we're trying, Jack? What types? Can you remember what you said? The word. Fino, that's Fino, dry. not Vino, yeah. <laughs> dry. dry, seco, <laughs> Fino seco. Creme. Um, creme. And Muscat Muscat Muscatel. Muscatel. Okay. Gonna try them. So this is in the market. We're still in the market. We had it. Chris, Chris has bought a cookie. Biggest Chris the cookie dry. monster. Yeah. Like vinegar, I would say. No. no. Is that now we have it, the tortilla de camaroni. What's it like, Jack? It tastes like a potato lattic with What's them prawns. That? Shredded potato, like a hash brown. Ah, with prawns a, in. I a suppose, Spanish hash brown. Possibly. It hasn't got, this one hasn't got that many little prawns in. You can see the eyes there. So if I show you the, um, the, the camarones, the small, tiny little prawns are there. You can buy them in a glass. What culinary, culinary, culinary delights have we got now? Queso. Mahu. Mahu cerveza. This is the bar Manteca in Cadiz. Um, with stories of bullfighting and. Yeah. Lots of history. Bullfighting. Lots of history. Newspaper clippings from 1950s. Photos of. That. Somebody preparing for a bullfight in the 1950s. The bell ringing is a sign that somebody's left a tip. <laughs> Here we are in Jerez today. So we had Cadiz yesterday, and now I'm taking the boys to for a little tour of Jerez de la Frontera and explaining that Jerez in Spanish means sherry. So it's spelled J-E-R-E-Z. And um, yeah, it means sherry because there are hundreds of bodegas here. Let's just have a little peek through this gate and see what it is. It looks like it might be nice gardens. I've never seen behind here before. Oh, I don't know. Hola, on our food trail today, we're, we're here in Ferez. Come, come, look. <laughs> we have the signature Spanish dish. <laughs> Churros <laughs> with cinnamon, sugar. Oh, yes. Traditionally, it's in sticks, but he's doing it in circles. So that's true, that's true. Delicious. <laughs> Everyone on the marketplace is having churros today. It must be a Saturday. <laughs> <laughs> what have we got over here? Snails. <laughs> on our TV trail today. Lovely, it's all um, mint. These are called, uh, I can't remember the name of them. Coya, Coya, something. How do they call them? Taganina. Oh, no. Taganina. Yeah. 
Might as well see. Oh, look. Chris the snails. The fresh, the moving. That's disgusting. Hola, Hola. Uh, Ah, what are them we What's that? I don't know actually, I don't know. They're all sunny. Yeah. Oh, There's a pear in it. There's a rhubarb. Look at that. Oh. More snails. Me, Jamie, and me and my sister, Jamie, are doing a black cream and burgundy thing. Right, it's nice, but it's a very heavy fabric. Um, let's just see. Let's go back to that black and cream one that I like. This, Jamie's, is similar to this, but bigger spots. That's nice, and that's a nice floral fabric. These are called Volantes, frills, Volantes. And this is called Canista style dress, which hasn't got frills, but it's got gathers. <laughs> so I'll see the ladies trying them on and it might give us some inspiration. This is the one I think I would go for out of all of them in here. That's 275, that's cheap for them in contracts. Now we're heading to the hilltop town of Veje de la Frontera, a little bit closer to the coast. It's an unusual fountain with a little frogs in it. Mm. Veje, Veje de la Frontera. Yeah. Lovely ties. Very famous for fiestas. There's loads of fiestas here. Noche de las Velas. De las Velas, where there's lots of candles around. It has a jazz festival. This week is actually ferry week, but this is it. It's in a different part of the town, not in the centre. We were at that last night. The boys were very well Here's behaved. Here's the amigos. Hola. <laughs> the boys were super behaved at the ferry. Yeah, they were very cultural. They enjoyed the horses. In the distance, we've got the sea, and we're actually heading down to the beach, El Parma Beach. There's a fantastic restaurant um, called yes. Leslie to go to. Yeah, hotel yeah, yeah. This hotel restaurant down, down here down. called La Califa is a um, stunning, stunning place to stay in the Oh my goodness, it's that seems <laughs> That's original. <laughs> this gallery. Can I see what I bought? Oh, I just rolled them up, but I'll show you them when they're on the wall. Amazing pictures. Um, maybe I can, oh, I can show you this. I'll show you this. That one's rolled up. There we are. Leslie when she's older. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on, hang on, hang on. 
Yeah. Uh -huh. Basque so cheesecake. Yeah, the Basque cheesecake from the San Sebastian region. Um, La Vigna, I think it said. Yes, Basque. 1980. Is that what it was? Northern, yeah. In northern Spain. It was founded and the culinary experts um, took it worldwide to France. And it's now on many dishes or menus, I should say, around the world. And it's cooked at a higher temperature, which, which yeah. what give it, gives it the burnt appearance on the top. No, um, no five garnishes, no garnishes, very basic, yeah. Five Good. ingredients. Five ingredients. We've yeah. just read this, by the way. We didn't know it. On Wikipedia. Yeah. <laughs> but we'll give it a try. We'll try it. Let's do it. You try, you try. Okay, I'll try, I'll try. I'll try. You try, you try, I'll you try. try. Okay. I'll, I'll try at the same I'll time try. then. I'll try. You try, you try. Oh, there's no base to it either. It's literally just the Oh my cake. gosh, it's going to be gorgeous. I love basic cheesecake. Oh, yum. Is it really nice? Mm. Taste, taste, taste. Oh my god, it's amazing. Mm. Oh, it is. <laughs> oh, that's lovely. <laughs> right, I'm gone before I eat it all. <laughs> this is called the root of love. Like the root that we've taken with all those hearts that highlight it. You hungry? <coughs> what time is it? It's only 12 o'clock. You can go like longer than that without a bite to eat. <laughs> a beautiful wall. Yes. Oh, you turned right, that was a perfect... Oh, was picture. it? I'll take... I'll turn back then and you can get another picture. And here we are in a place called? The head of the head. Oh, look. The size, the beach, the best of both worlds. Yeah, exactly. Spain's open gems. <laughs> Breakfast wasn't expensive, 34 euros for three of us. We had sandwiches, had tuna, fun. avocado. Orange juice, and coffee. Class, and two starts. coffees. We did have two coffees each. That yeah. was actually quite quite good. Exactly. Two coffees, orange, plus and sandwiches. Classic tostada. Yeah. We're walking through an old Roman. Uh, I always like just like to see a shadow of a castle wall. That looks so good. It's the smell here. Yeah. Can you explain the smell to the viewers, please, Jack? If you were to wear a perfume, like your grandma's perfume, it's like that. <laughs> Pungent, floral, delicate smell. <laughs> That's where you describe a very descriptive way of uh, explaining the scent here. Yeah, but I'll describe is, it. Uh, what's the... Um, what's the plant on the side? I was going to say jasmine. Jasmine and petunias. Yeah, it is actually the smell of jasmine. Um, and there's one. Same day, different place. So it was Vehe earlier. We've had um, lunch, lots of seafood. <laughs> yeah, more food. We've had an hour on this beach. And now we're in Homies. A hip bar called Homies. We're getting some ice cream. Look at this lovely kid. So cool. He's so yeah. cool. Just a little flashback to show how I met Chris. We used to work together teaching fitness over quite a long time. And then of course I met his partner Jack through through Chris. And here we are now, not working in fitness, but um, burning the holiday calories off together once again. If you'd like to see more videos like this of um, shenanigans around Spain, and a little bit of information on purchasing property in living and living in Spain as well as actual properties. Please subscribe to the channel.